What's up? It's I'm Bonkers 23 coming at you live from the from the crib. Coming at you live from the crib. Coming at you live from the crib. Coming at you live from the crib. You know what I'm saying? I'm crazy. I'm crazy. And I'll. Alright. Alright. Anyways. I might be crazy, but you know what's even crazier? What I'm about to tell you next. Listen, put, put, get, up, get it up here. Up there. It is up there. Okay. Hey, don't argue, camera lady. Listen. It's unbelievable. I, I, you guys probably are like, oh my god, everything is like, it's unbelievable. I don't know what else to say. Do I say it's unbelievable? I can't believe it. It's amazing. I mean, people are retarded. People are stupid. People are morons. What am I supposed to say? I don't know what to say. I really don't. I, I don't know. I can't put in words how I feel sometimes about the stupidity of everybody. I know I'm stupid sometimes. <sighs> you know, like me, when I'm running, jumping in the camera, hey, I might be dumb. I might be goofy. But I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not stupid. Okay? I might be goofy. I might be crazy. I might act like a retard. I might be a moron sometimes, but I'm not, I'm not really down to the core an idiot, okay? And, and I'm not a moron. I'm not stupid down to the core. And you know how I can tell you that I'm not and how I can prove it to you that I'm not? It's because if you listen to the things that I say, the things that I actually like am seriously talking about, they make a lot of sense, okay? There's a, there, in the state of Wisconsin where I live, um, Russ Feingold was a senator or whatever, and we, you know, our race was just now and, and tonight. Okay, so this is nightly news, doo -doo -doo, just in. Scott Walker wins, okay, this guy named Scott Walker. So, honey, what, Scott Walker, what? He wants to end birth control, you said? He wants to make it illegal in the state of Wisconsin. So, you have a crisis of money and spending, and he's on there, I heard it a little bit ago, well, oh, there's the spending and... And we're going to, you know, we're cutting the spending right now. Like, his first thing was, oh, right, what are you going to do tomorrow, your first day? The lady says, what are you going to do tomorrow, your first day? What are you going to do? And, you know, she's, he's like, oh, well, tomorrow I'm getting right to work, and we are ending all the spending right then, bam, tomorrow. It's like, dude, are you kidding me? Because you don't know those real secrets. Because, see, that's a problem. Like, every president says, I can do this and this and this, and they don't know about all the secret crap that only the president and the little cabinet knows about. So then what happens is the president of the little cabinet, then they go in there and they're like, holy cow, we got to pay for that. Well, I didn't know about that we owed, we're going to pay this country that much money. I thought we could skim off of that fund. Well, no, because that fund goes to that country. Oh, okay, I guess we can't skim there. Oh, and then next thing you know, now he hasn't cut any of the deficit. And oh, now he's like, oh, geez, you know, I couldn't. Well, yeah, we can't. It ain't going to get any better. It's going to get worse before it gets better. Is everybody stupid? How, where do you think they're going to get trillions and billions and trillions of dollars if they just print up and money ain't worth nothing? It's Nobody has any ending in sight. There's not one person out there that can come up with an actual reasonable solution to the whole entire problem of this whole entire country and the economy. And then, so on top of that, now you want to add to this guy, who's who's now the senator of Wisconsin. He wants to pass a bill that says, oh, you, he wants to make abortion illegal and birth control. So, now this is how I prove I'm not stupid. Because he's fucking stupid and I don't agree with it. Plain and simple, that's it. I mean, it, it's not like... You know, brain science here. You're gonna sit there and birth control. That's every woman's right. That's just like a medication. That's not, you know, um, I'm pregnant and I'm killing my baby with the day after pill or whatever or anything like that. I'm taking birth control so I, my hormones stay good, so I don't get cramps. A lot of women use birth control for many and millions of different reasons, rather other than just only and solely. You know, there's women out there that use birth control that have husbands that have their tubes tied or their wiener tied or whatever so then they can't even get pregnant but they take it so then their cramps aren't bad and stuff like that so then now they can't take it well that's just like a medicine that's like taking med that's like might as well make migraine headache medicine illegal too because the guy's got headaches he, he shouldn't have his meds either let him have cramps in his head 
I mean, you know, that is the most retardist thing to do. And even if it was only just to get to not have kids, so what? So you're now you're gonna have all these chicks out there getting knocked up and having all these babies, and then with all these different daddies, and then what's gonna happen? Oh, now they, they can't. Now the the government's trying to track them all down to pay their child support, so then that costs money for you know the counties and stuff. And then oh, now what happens? Oh, now all these people are in programs like oh Badger Care and this and that and welfare and blah 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 because they need help with the kid from the state. So now the state's paying even more money out. So now you didn't help the deficit. Now you created more. I mean, now you're gonna need instantly if you ended birth control. Think seriously. If you ended birth control in any state. And he wants to end uh, freedom of choice too, and I won't even get into that. That's just I I won't even go there. Okay, I I think it's everybody's right to do whatever they want. I you know, but I'm not gonna go there. But I think the birth control thing is absolutely asinine. I mean, how can you seriously say you have common sense and that you want to end birth control? What would happen? Instantly, you'd have people can bring it everywhere. If they ended it and took it away, people would not. What, now he wants everybody to use condoms? I mean, come on. That is just unbelievably retarded. Stupid. Anybody that agrees with that is a freaking idiot. You And he's he's our senator now? I mean, geez, Louise. It, it's, the world's coming to an end, son. See you next time.